Riverdale Farms is that little taste of country feel in the big city. Toronto, not normally associated with farm animals or the open sky or with the country music genre, but that's all starting to change. Yeah, I heard Steven Tyler say that country is the new rock and roll. It's gonna get loud, like Ontario born and raised Tim Hicks has been touring the province for the last decade and he's heading out on tour with fellow country singers Madeline Merlot and Tebe. What we all do is different um, but it's also in the same genre and in the same country world and that's really cool and that makes a show like ours exciting because you can everyone there's a bit for everybody there. Girls they all have had success on the Canadian country music charts and on Toronto stages. They believe the genre of music is starting to get more love in the big smoke. And I have a sneaking suspicion that the number of country fans have has remained the same in Toronto, but they're now feeling empowered to come out. You know, come on, come on out to the countryside. It's all good. The trio kick off the Get Loud cross country tour on Thursday in Toronto and can't help but joke about some of the stereotypes surrounding country music. Oh man, it's thinking about trucks in every song or drinking beer. Actually, Tim does a lot of that. Um, <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, I think, I think the cool thing about country music is there's a lot of different vibes within the genre. There's people like myself that kind of lean a little bit more on the pop side of country music. Um, and then you got someone like Tim that's just like a down home blue collar type of dude. And that's, uh, that's cool. We're all, we're all a little bit different, but we're all in the same genre. <laughs> It's time to wake up, everybody. <laughs> time to wake up. That was amazing. I'll take it, but would you guys like to try to recreate that with me? Well, I'll do it together, okay, so we're not sure. alone. All right, you ready? ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> Make sure to check them out. They're in Toronto on November 1st. <laughs>